what's the best way of dealing with the fine lines under the eyes? Fine lines under the eyes are the bane of the life of so many of my patients. And it's kind of frustrating because the lines that you get at the sides of the eyes can be easily corrected with injectables. The hollowness under the eyes can be improved with some fillers, but those fine little lines that you get and the crackiness that develops under there respond really badly to injectables. A lot of people think that if you add filler below the eye into the tear trough, that is going to correct the fine line issue, and it's not. The tear trough is the deeper groove that is between the eyelids and the cheek, rather than these little creases that exist below the eye. And if you try and inject filler into the eyelid skin up here, the skin is so thin, it just looks bumpy, uneven, and it doesn't look very nice. People talk about using microneedling, PRP, creams, lotions, potions, and all sorts of other tricks for taking care of these fine lines. But in my experience, none of these things work. The only consistently successful thing that I have found for dealing with these problem lines is laser skin resurfacing. Not the modern fancy kind of fractional skin resurfacing, but the good old fashioned full field ablation where we have to take off the entire surface of the skin and allow it to heal from scratch. Full field ablation is a pretty aggressive treatment. First of all, we start by numbing you up with some numbing injections, similar to what you get at the dentist. Then we need to place some anesthetic eye drops into your eyes themselves because we need to protect your eye from the laser. And then we place little metal contact lenses to protect the eye from any damage from the laser. So that in itself is not a lot of fun, but it's a necessary safety precaution that we have to do when we are getting this close to the eye. Next, we take the laser and it's actually a relatively quick procedure. The eyelid is not a big area. We can treat it in as little as a few minutes. Afterwards, you look as though you have been burned pretty badly. It takes about 10 days to heal after this procedure and there can be some redness and puffiness that is going to hang around for a few weeks. It probably again takes two to three months to get to the full final outcome of the treatment. But in my experience, nothing works as effectively as doing the laser resurfacing. You can see the remarkable difference that a single treatment has managed to achieve in the crepiness under her eyes. That is a pretty incredible transformation. Because this is a bigger laser procedure to go through, when we're doing it, we tend to combine it with other types of lasers elsewhere on the face. For example, this was a younger patient that we treated, so when we did this, we also took care of her acne scarring at the same treatment session. In a more mature patient, we maybe do some other types of, maybe a halo laser for some sun damage. But generally, if you are gonna have that 10 day downtime, we want to make the most of it and get you the best overall improvement in your skin that we can achieve. It's not a quick and easy fix, unfortunately, but if you want the best improvement you can get in those fine lines under the eyes, full field laser resurfacing is the answer. Any questions or suggestions for future content, please pop them in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.